I do not know what in the white lot Wonder Bread this series is about. At the bare minimum, I know it's something about people dealing with curses. And that's mostly because I've seen clips of one girl with short hair and she has nails and a cursed doll. And uh, I was kind of clued in that, okay, so they use curses. Because, uh, you know, that's a very common Japanese thing. The person who, you take the hair from someone you hate, put it in the doll, nail the doll to a tree. They're cursed and stuff like that. So that's the bare minimum of what I know. Like, they go to a school, they use curses, and they fight. Other than that, nothing. Oh, and the ending to the first season, the ending song to the first season was a bop. Other than that, nothing. So, completely blind. But, this thing is popular as all get out, and, eh, I got a little bit more time on my hands lately, so I figured I'd check out. What's the deal with Jujutsu Kaisen? Now, when I'm checking out something I have no idea what it's about, I also love to check out the manga as well, just to see if there's are any differences or anything like that that I can enjoy on the side. So, if that's not your thing, I understand, but I will be popping over to the manga in between, just checking out, hey, okay, what's the difference here? What's the difference there? How does everything match up? So, without further ado, Let's check out Jujutsu Kaisen, which I wondered why they just called it the Japanese name up until I found out what it translates to in English. They were right to keep calling it Jujutsu Kaisen. Just saying. Good morning. Hmm. Jujutsu Kaisen by Gege Akatama. Yeah, all I know so far is that the opening is very different in the anime. A lot of markers. Oh, it's the double Kakashi guy. Whereas Kakashi covers up one side, this dude covers up both. Yeah, I know this guy is really popular. So which one of you right now? Aren't you? Oh, Gojo. Okay. Satoru. Okay, so his name is Gojo. Okay. I've heard that name before. Again, most popular character as far as I know. I'm in charge of the first years at Jujutsu Tech. Jujutsu Tech? Huh. Fushiguro Senpai? Oh, he's bound. Is he possessed? What is this? Jeez. Those are a lot of seal. He must have like a really powerful demon inside of him. I'm not sure you should be worrying about others. Itadori Yuji. Hmm. It's been decided that you'll be secretly executed. Whoa. Oh, is this the opening? Okay. There's water in that train? What? Huh. Oh, those trains are like ley lines. The mystical side of stuff. Okay. Okay, this opening's not bad. Yeah, that chick. She's familiar to me. She's cute. A panda? Oh, a guy in white clothes. Oh, what the hell? Okay, so it's the mystical world kind of one that only certain kinds of people could see. Hmm. Oh, <laughs> cool. Uh, uh. Yeah, nails. <laughs> that panda's par parkouring? Uh, uh. Okay, this looks pretty good. Oh, okay, so he is possessed by a demon. Hmm, huh, fascinating. Yomen Sakuna. Sukuna? Hello, Sigawa Hospital. Oh, this is Itadori. I just called earlier. Yes, yes. I'm sorry I to keep calling, but how is my grandpa doing? Huh, I thought they already told you. Oh, please hold on. I'll go ask myself. Huh. Itadori never uses his call button. It's actually scary that he doesn't. Itadori, you have a phone call. He's been asking if you want him to bring you any. Leave me alone. Tell him I'm not coming. You should go to his club. His club. <laughs> uh, so the grandpa is stubborn. And the only way he can find out anything about him is to contact. Okay. Is his grandpa his only family? What? What's going on? You heard him. What club are you in, Yuchi? I heard. I'll come by tomorrow evening. Huh. Clubs. Mayashiro Prefecture Tsugusawa Third High School. Huh. Okay. They're keeping a curse object in a place like this. Okay. Now we're at the beginning of the manga. Could they be any dumber? A thermo a thermometer shed. That's what that is apparently. Huh. Someone's talking to him in the manga. Haha, <laughs> recovering it should be no problem then. Is it the Gojo dude? Dude's kinda got a light tone to him. <laughs> Oh, there's nothing here. Huh? The Stevenson screens 
empty. Stevenson screen? What the hell is a Stevenson screen? I'm not looking it up for real. That's hilarious. Maybe you took a nighttime stroll. I'll punch you. Well, no going home until it's recovered, okay? Oof. I'm seriously gonna punch him next time. Okay. Okay, it had to be the Gojo, dude. We've only seen only but two dudes. Ready to go? Are you sure? So here we go. Sasaki Senpai, Suguchi Senpai. The manga spells it out. Sagasui and Mizneshiro High School number three, first year student Yuji Itadori, second year student Occult Research Club Sasaki, second year student Occult Research Club Ichiguchi. Iguchi. Okay, so the Occult Research Club. Gotcha. Okay, here we go. Spirits, spirits, please tell us which creature is the council president just barely weaker than the angel. The angel can beat him. Occult Club. A Plankton President. As you were previously informed, a research club with no real activities must forfeit its club room. Okay. Huh. It's been a while since I've watched an anime where it was debates over which uh, club can actually have rooms and stuff like that. So vacate this room at once. You shouldn't underestimate our members, President. Nope. What is that? <laughs> you know about a rugby field being closed off, right? Yes. Some of the students who fell ill were actually hospitalized. Don't you think that's strange? We're talking about tough rugby players here. Truth is, the players said they started hearing mysterious sounds of voices right before they fell ill. Hmm. That's when we found this new page for article 30 years ago. It talks about the disappearance of Yoshida-san, who worked with the construction company. And it mentions he was si last sighted here at Sagisawa Third High School during construction. Yoshida was struggling to make ends meet, so he turned to Lone Shark. And those organizers were after him. Which means, the whole disaster at the rugby field was caused by a vent the vengeful spirit of Yoshida-san, who's buried there. <laughs> Wow, those are some massive leaps in logic, but I mean, hey, no, it was caused by tricks. By ticks, sorry. Hard ticks. A large blood sucking bug. If one bites you and affects you with SFTs, severe fever with uh, syndrome, it can be fatal. Ugh, so be careful. Ugh. This is why I don't go outside. No, thank you. So what? The occult club is trying to uncover occult activity, so it's still a proper club activity report. This isn't some kids' game. Besides, the biggest problem is you. Itsudori Yuji. Wait, why is it him? You're registered with track and field, not the occult club. Oh, really? So the club doesn't even have the three members required for any activity. Huh? Itsudori. No, I... No, I wrote down the occult club. I rewrote it. The track and field club track again. Itsudori, we need you so we can conquer the nationals. You can't just rewrite which club someone chooses to join. God. Just as even worse than the coaches who tried to recruit me for football in high school. Like, if I wanted to join football, I'd have joined football. But what's worse, I still get asked if I was in football. No! Leave me alone! Why are you speaking to me? A teacher more problematic than the students just showed up. Give it a rest, how many times do I have to tell you I refuse? You can't, why can't I? However, I'm not some demon. If you can beat me, then I'll give up on you. Let's sell it fair and square on the track. Now that's interesting. You're on. <laughs> <laughs> the hell is going on? Is it fair and square to rewrite a student's club application? No, no it isn't. What is going on? This kind of makes me think of Bleach though. <laughs> Just the craziness of the high school sometimes. That's with the rugby field. Oh, oh, it is possessed. Is there a dead body buried here or something? There is a dead body there. Even if there is, I'm surprised to see one this high level. It's probably a grade 2 curse. Must be curse objects influence. Damn it. Its presence is too strong to pin down. Feels like it's close by, but it should still be far away too. The special grade 8 curse objects is a serious pain. What the hell? Who could have moved it? Where is it now? Hmm. Over here. Coach Tataki is m taking on Mido Itadori from West Middle. Oh, what are they competing in? Oh, what the fuck? Shot put. 14 meters. Japan's national goal record. 18 meters. Oh, Takagi has got still got it. What are you gonna Itadori? Hey, is Itadori famous or something? They're probably tall tales, but I heard he beat all stages of Ninja Warrior. <laughs> what? <laughs> he, he what? <laughs> 
Is it Itadori like buffed to shit or something? And that he's the reincarnation of Miracle Pro Pop? What? I have no idea what that is. But Miracle's not even dead yet. Okay. So he earned the nickname Tiger of West Middle. Lame. Hey, can I throw this ball however I want? Yep, I won't call any fouls. So throw however you please. Sorry. I wanted to demonstrate how serious I am by intentionally choosing something that isn't your forte. Holy shit. Roughly 30 meters. Okay then. Okay, so he's superhuman. Gotcha. Is he naturally superhuman or strangely superhuman? God, he really does make me think of Ichigo from Bleach. Just a little bit more peppy. Because Ichigo just insanely has fighting abilities, but then we learn things about why he's like that. Yeah, I win. He's more gorilla than Tiger, is it? Oh, it's a pitcher's throw. It's adorable. You do well on a sports team. You don't have to force yourself to stay in a cult club, you know? Huh? But as much as you two love scary things, you can go to haunted places without me, can't you? Aww. Uh, the manga goes into detail. Well, I've got my reasons that I need to be home by five. Besides, everyone needs to be in a club, right? So that's why you don't have to do anything... You can be like a phantom member, kind of fitting for the occult research club, right? Uh, okay. So, they're flexible. That's why he joined. We're scared because we like it. Besides, the school requires everything to be in a club. Okay, there's the explanation. I couldn't keep up with this. I did say that. I want to be home by... To be able to go home by 5 p.m. for my own reasons. Okay. I like the atmosphere of the occult club a lot. Well, if that's how it is, we don't mind. Yeah, that guy's incredible. He pulled that off without any cursed energy. Okay, so he's not supernaturally strong. Weird. Huh. I wonder if he's like Zeni Senpa. Oh, okay. So this dude knows somebody like him. Uh, it's already half past four. Well, coach, I've got stuff to do later. Oh, what happened? Whoa, the presence of the cursed object. Hey, you, he's way too fast. I heard he can run 50 meters in three seconds. Is he a car? <laughs> That dude's face when he heard that, like, what? And he's picking up stuff for his gramps. I told you not to come. Stop buying flowers to bring with you all the time. Besides, they aren't for you, they're for the nurses. All the more reason not to. And what about your club? Go to your club, your club. Ah, oh, chill out. Dance before 5 p.m. I wouldn't be visiting you if I didn't have the free time. Good. Then listen to me, since I've got free time too. Not interested. Just listen well. There's something I wanted to tell you before the end. It's about your parents. I said I'm not interested. Grandpa, could you stop trying to act all cool before you die? <laughs> oh, man. Just listen to your grandpa. He wants to tell you something. Ah. <sighs> It would suck if he died without telling you something really important. Then again, you might be trying to keep him alive by not having those final words spoken. Old man could always just leave it in a letter. Every man wants to go out in style, you know? Get a clue, you useless grandson. Quit snapping over everything. You can just be yourself. Ugh. Lacks upbringing. Huh, I do wonder about his parents though. Were he, were they the reason why he's so strong? Yuji, you're a strong kid, so help others. Even if it's only those closest to you, just save the people you can. It's okay if you lose your way, and don't worry about whether they'll thank you or not. Just save as many people as you can, even if it's only one. When you die, you should be surrounded by people. Don't end up like, oh, jeez. That is... <laughs> That's profoundly sad. But it's true. No, that's something I try to adapt. Even though I'm very antisocial by nature, which is why I do this because I can talk into essentially the void and know people will listen, but only if they want to listen. So I don't have to force people to listen to what I have to say or what I enjoy. It's just like if you're here, I mean, you must be enjoying it to some degree or morbid curiosity. But you well. Know, just do for others where you can. You know, try to do a, as right by as many people as I can. Here, where I can. Uh, I don't quite go out of my way, but I don't brush people off fully. It's just how it is. Grandpa? No way. No way! Guess what's the matter? Hello? Oh shit, my grandpa is dead. Holy shit. Holy shit! I thought, I don't know, I, I kind of thought his grandpa would 
live maybe just a little bit longer. You know, he'd be around for maybe like half the season or something. Oh, jeez. Shit, I really wish he had gotten to tell his grandson about his parents or anything, but those were some damn good parting words. I'll say that much. Ah, oh, damn. Poor kid. Does he have anyone else? Oh, God, I'm, I'm literally getting teary because that's so sad. Notification of death. Okay, that's all the necessary paperwork. Okay, thank you for everything. Are you sure you're okay? Well, this is my first time dealing with something like this, so I don't want to feel real yet. Grandpa would snap if I kept moping around forever, though. Poor kid. Oh, I feel so bad for him. So I'll just have to laugh as I roast the phrasing. Oh, ooh, Itadori Yuji, right? I'm Fugu Fushi Fushigoro from Jujutsu High School. I'd like to have a word with you now. Uh, I'm in mourning right now. Sorry, but there isn't time. The cursed object you possess is very dangerous. Hand it over to me right now. Cursed object? This. Oh, yeah, yeah. I found it. I don't mind either way, but my senpais took a liking to it. What do you mean, dangerous? The number of unexplained deaths and missing persons within Japan exceeds 10,000 a year on average. Jeez. Most of those are the result of curses. Curses? I don't care if you believe in them or not. They're real. I'll go on. Large pools of negative energy from form especially easily in schools, hospitals, and so on. Yeah, because, uh, <laughs> stressful environments and all that. A lot of, uh, suicides in Japan tend to be from high school students, too, as far as I've heard. Hardship, regret, shame. The negative emotions of mankind become a source of curses. That's why most schools secretly keep a cursed object such as a protective talisman. The object you found is one of them. If it's protecting us, shouldn't we be grateful for it? Let me finish. Placing a cursed object of greater evil is a deadly poison that keeps other curses away. It's a bad practice that only claims to protect. Over the years, its seals weaken, and then it becomes bait to lure in and fatten up other curses. Jesus. The object you found is a dangerous one classified as a special grade. Hand it over before people start dying. Hey, I already said I don't mind that. Oh, so go tell my senpai. It's empty. I was just following the tainted taint clinging to the box. Where are the contents? I already told you my senpais have it. But actually, they were talking about removing the talismans from it tonight at school. What? Is that bad? It's worse than bad. They're going to die. Uh-oh. Oh no, is this one of those situations where the kids you were best friends with at school all end up dying? Oh no, I kind of like these guys. They're good people. But then again, that might be the point. I can't get it off. Do we really need to sneak in to do this? I'm turning on the lights. No, the atmosphere is important. Enjoying the thrill is in the spirit of the occult club, isn't it? It's not like anything's gonna happen anyway. Oh, oh, it came off. Oh, jeez. The hell is it? Oh, God, it's a finger! A human finger? Is it real? Oh, shit. Is this... What is this? Jesus. Do talismans come off that easily? Yeah. No, it's impossible for people who lack cursed energy normally. Go right. It's a shortcut. This time, the object itself is too strong. The seal is ancient. It might as well be plain paper. I don't... I still don't get all this stuff about curses. Where are they? Fourth floor. Oh, what is this pressure? You stay here. I'm coming too. It's dangerous, right? I've only known them a few months, but they're my friends. I can't just stand by. Stay here. Oh shit. What time is it? Jesus. The power hand is at 11. What the hell does that mean? Oh, Jesus. What is that monster? Saki. Higuchi, thank goodness. Where have you helped me? Oh, God. What's on his head? Oh, jeez. What time is it? Oh, the curse has been unleashed. Its presence is still all over the place. Oh, what the hell? Out of the way. Whoa, demon dogs. What? Cool. You can eat it. I'm uh, just gonna wait here like you, like you told me to. What am I so afraid of? They're going to die. That's right. I could sense death all the way out here. I'm afraid of dying. Was I afraid of it then? It didn't feel like I was though. I didn't cry because I was scared. I was just a little sad. But my grandpa's death and the death I'm facing now, how are they any different? I mean, one's a murderous death and the one's kind of peacefully just going in your sleep. I mean, the old man just kind of faded. I shit. 
all things considered, we can only be so lucky to just pass on. You know? Unless he was suffering from something. You're a strong kid, so help others. Hmm. Whoa. Cool. The curses are growing in number. They're close. Whoa. Oh. oh, Jesus. Oh my god. Found him. Jeez. The one demon. It's like groping up a storm on the one chick. He was short tempered and stubborn. No one but me ever paid him a visit. Don't end up like me, huh? That's true. I was trying to swallow her along with the cursed object. Not gonna make it. Oh, what? What the hell? It's a door. I think you had a proper death, Grandpa. But, what? This death is wrong. So, this is a curse. Not what I was expecting. Oh, nice. I want to ask you what you're doing here, but good job. Why so haughty? By the way, what's that munching on the curse? My Shikigami. You can see them then? Normally, you can't. curses can't be seen. Not unless you're on the verge of death or in the special places like this. Yeah, that makes sense. I've never seen a ghost or anything before tonight. You're not scared, are you? Well, I was uh, scared for a bit. But did you know? People really can die, huh? So, I at least want the people I know to have proper death. See, exactly. There's a difference between uh, just being killed by something and being just able to pass on peacefully. Not that I really get it myself. This is it? Yeah. That's the special grade cursed object, Yoma Sukuna finger. Huh. It's a miracle it didn't get swallowed. Why would anything eat it? Does it taste good? Don't be stupid. You do it to gain stronger cursed energy. It's dangerous, so hand it over already. Yeah, sure. Uh-oh. Run. Oh, jeez. Oh. Shigoto. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, and there goes Shirigami. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Damn it. I can't think straight. Oh, the door. What raw strength. Why can't you understand to take those two and run? You're in big trouble yourself. Oh, jeez. Only curses can exercise other curses. You can't beat it. Is this the time to be saying that? You're gonna die at this rate. Jeez, this kid is strong. If I went home now, I'd be having nightmares. Besides, I have my own troublesome curse already. Oh! Hand it over to me or you'll be eaten too! Jesus! Why would anyone eat it? Does it taste good? Don't be stupid! You do it to gain stronger cursed energy! There is a way to save everyone! I just need some cursed energy, right? Fuchigoda? <laughs> oh shit! You're shitting me! He ate it?! Rima sick in his finger. It's a special grade A curse object. It's a deadly poison, he'll die for sure! But there's a one in a million... One in a million chance! Oh shit! What? And now he's become a cursed being. Oh shit. Oh shit! Oh no. I knew it. The light feels best in the flesh. This is the worst. A one in a million chance. Worst case outcome. The special grade cursed object has incarnated. A cursed spirit's flesh is so boring. Where are the people? The woman. What a wonderful era to be in. Women and children are crawling everywhere like a maggot. Marvelous. It'll be a massacre. Oh. Oh, what do you think you're doing with my body? Give it back. How are you able to move? I mean, it's my body. <laughs> oh shit. Okay. He's like, so, because he, he's not a normal human being. Okay. He's suppressing me? Don't move. You're no longer human. Under Jujutsu regulations, Itadori Yuji. I will exercise you as a curse. Oh, okay. And the next part is preview. That was kind of wild. Take a little peek at the next chapter. Oh, it's the beginning of, uh, this. So, like, the part where he opens his eyes, and he meets Gojo. And they're in the room with all the talisman. So which one are you right now? Aren't you? Gojo Sato. In uh, charge of first years at Jujutsu Tech. Jujutsu. Oh, and he asks for his senpai. Fushigoro senpai. And he sees he's tied down. What is this? I'm not sure you should be worrying about others. Itadori Yuji. It's been decided that you'll be secretly executed. Okay, and there we go. So you had the first chapter and a little bit into the second chapter. Gotcha. Oh, that is wild. Okay, and then it's a flashback. Okay. I, I understand why they started the episode off with this, because it's fascinating. 
It's like your execution has been set. It's a daughter Yuji. But, I mean, I've seen the opening. It looks like he joins Jujutsu Academy or whatever. Because I guess he's able to control the curse. Fascinating. And he was already abnormal to begin with. So, I guess his abnormal body, it isn't... I guess it isn't the result of any... It's the fact that his grandpa passed away without telling Yuji about his parents. So I have to... I find myself kind of assuming there's something special about Yuji. Although I like the fact that it's been set up that there might be something special about Yuji because of his parents. And like with Bleach where you find out Ichigo's special much later on. And it's just kind of like, okay, how special are we talking? Hmm. I don't, I keep comparing this to Bleach, but that's just because of the fact that, I don't know, something about the main character really makes me think of Ichigo. It's pretty cool though, I like it. So tell me your thoughts in the comments section below. Would you consume a cursed object to save your friends? Have you ever had sports teams clamoring to recruit you? Let me know that and more in the comments section below. And subscribe, that way you don't miss out on my next video. Or don't, I ain't your daddy but I still love you like one. Until next time, I've been Deuce Diz Din, and I hope to see you in the next video. Until then, buh bye bye